Hey everyone, it's Viv again. As requested by many of you, today I am going to do a showcase of my wardrobe. So I have 87% wardrobe right now. And the last time I checked, I have 260 suits. Um, someone told me that this video would take three hours. I swear, it's not gonna be three hours. I gotta make this as fast as I can. So I'm gonna go to suits. Uh, let's skip the first four because these are my own customized suits. Number one, voice of heart, the recharge suit most recently. Number two, celebrity's choice. Pose one, boom! The I do coat, oh, so useless. I'm so upset because I actually had to remove this coat from so many of my quest stages because it's no longer top scoring anymore. Oh. Up next, the original pose. And then we have Eternal Instant, pose one, pose two, Dark Reborn. Bounty Hunter, oh my gosh, this was like a, I believe it was $1 suit and it only appeared in game for two days So a lot of my friends told me they were unable to get that, to get the suit for that reason oh. Volt Seal is next It's like a sexy diva from Overwatch outfit And then we have Artificial Idol The pretty ruined suit and then, OMG. The most expensive suit in game would be Ode to Glory, and it comes in three different poses. This is $100! <laughs> um, I actually got this for 25% off, so technically $75 because I use Amazon coins and there's always a discount on Amazon coins. It's so good. Um, up next, it's the pose without the wings. And then it's the original pose. Dragon! Oh yeah! Oh, this dragon is everything! Up next we have Guardian of Purity. Pose 1. And pose two. This was a recharge suit. And then we have Barney is a dinosaur. <laughs> uh, back to free history suit. And initially, when I saw the trailer for this dinosaur event, I thought it had to do with some Jurassic Park style. I love Jurassic Park and Jurassic World. But it turns out to be like some Barney looking suit. <laughs> Still really cute though. I love the plushie. Um, next, we have... Easter Bunny, pose one, and check out the leg when I do the other pose because it looks like she gained a foot by changing poses. Oh, look, she got shorter. It's like pose two, pose one. Oh, oh man, yeah, this is the legs are funny. <laughs> Up next is Spring Fantasia. And I love the arm pose hair. It's so adorable. And here is the original pose with the arms down. Momo's Adventure. It was a ruined suit from a recharge event. Clover Ceremony was a St. Patrick's Day user shop. Sweet Spell, a 20 dollar recharge suit and I just want to show this off a little bit because you don't get to see what's underneath but I think this dress piece is so sexy like without the coat and this coat looks really good by itself too love it love it as Lee would say she's spicy <laughs> up next blessed bark oh my gosh this is my most favorite Free suit. Oh, it's a pupper. I love you, little pupper. Oh. And here's the original pose with the doggy butt. I actually have this bag, <laughs> but I gave it to my friend Teddy Pom Pom. She's in my guild. Um, I gave it to her because she 
said she really liked the bag. So, <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. Up next, Phantom in Desert. Three poses here. One special pose with the tan skin. And the next special pose with the lighter skin. And then the original pose. Up next, go with a shadow. Also, three poses here. Here is the one with the tan skin. And then with the lighter skin. And then with the original pose. Without camo san. <laughs> uh, next, Ice Vault. It was a crafting suit. There's only three pieces for this special pose. <laughs> and here is the original pose. This is super easy to craft. I remember grabbing all the material within days. I was even able to craft this suit on my V0 Miracle Nikki account, so it was so easy, which made me so happy. A uh, Demon Lament is next. Ooh. The grand prize for the Vocaloid Hell event. And the original pose. Virtual Melody, also from the Vocaloid Hell event. Tornado Rhapsody. Vocaloid Hell event again. Thunder Beat. These are one of the earlier prize from the Vocaloid Hell event. And so is this one. I really like how this top looked like. And you don't really get to see it when it's the whole suit. But if you take it off, it's so cute. I love this top a lot. Alright. Up next we have Hip Hop Queen. And this was the event that introduced the color skin. That is so awesome. So here is Hot Beat. And here is the original pose. Yep, it includes the Hot Beat skin tone. I am loving the diversity here because I'm from America and you know, it's not just light skin people here. We have people of all skin tones. Like me, I'm I'm like tannish skin color just because I used to go out a lot. <laughs> go out in the sun a lot. And then there's this one. And original pose. This is a top and this is actually a bottom. And this bottom goes all the way up to her mouth. Street Extreme! This one introduced the Miss Skateboard skin tone. I really like this skin tone. I feel like this one matched my skin color a lot, especially after um, vacation in Hawaii. Uh, <laughs> anyway, here is the skateboard. And then we have Witch Hecate. Woo wee! So, me thick? She's spicy? <laughs> uh, so, that's the special pose. And here is the original pose. I feel like she got less thick. <laughs> T-H-I-C-C, -C, okay? Don't get any dirty thoughts in your head. She's less thick in her original pose. Up next, a Psalm of Time. This was a free suit. And I remember in the beginning when this suit first came out, there were so many bugs like with her pose. I'm, I'm glad it's fixed. I'm glad it's fixed. <laughs> Up next, Demon Huntress. Oh my gosh. I think this is my favorite gothic lolita suit. Love the umbrella. Love the leg pose. So cute. And then we have Snow Stone Tusk, aka Daenerys Targaryen from Game of Thrones. And there are her two pet dragons. Oh, I love it so much. There's the original pose without the arm pose. Up next we have Kalpa. Pose one. And pose two. Elegant two was a free set. Butterfly shade. A big a poofy dress we have for this European style event. <laughs> so here is the pose one and here is the pose two. She she just put her mask down so it seems like she's holding it um okay so up next we have where did i leave all that here white masquerade 
pose one with her hand held up sort of covering her face I really really like this makeup this is how it looks like oh darn the mask this makeup is so pretty I love the color we should have more color makeup like this it's so pretty Castle Sounds is next from the Vocaloid event not to be confused with the Vocaloid Hell event this one Two, Nebula Echo, also from the same event. Post one and post two. Dream Travel, post one and post two. I remember when this first came out, the items that were supposed to be animated were not animated. And I actually made a video on this a long, long time ago. So basically, this thing. The steady lion that was supposed to be moving was not moving. The feather that was supposed to be moving was not moving. And also these little daddy lions here too. Glad they fixed it. It looks a lot better moving. Uh, next, Moon Chaser. This is practically a free suit. It was so easy to get. And then Fluffy Gentleman from a recharge event. Here's Boo Boo and here's Mimi. <laughs> oh, my sweet cats. I love my sweet cats. Vendant game. Special pose with the teacup. You have to have completed the entire set before you got the teacup because here is the original pose without the teacup. And then we have City Dream, the suits of the shop. Blue Fantasy from the race car event. Track Blazer, also from the race car event. As Lee would say, she's spicy. <laughs> uh, Ultimate of the Way, which includes this really cool tattoo. You don't really get to see it with the coat covering it, but uh, that's how it looks like. And a prom princess with the special pose and the original pose. My goodness, this. This event needs to come back. Like, I don't have the other suit from this event, which is the male footballer. I didn't complete it because I was sort of new at the game at the time and didn't know what to do and didn't want to like spend my diamonds recklessly. Oh, so now whenever I click Apple, seeing that footballer grayed out and me not having it oh it just eats me up <laughs> uh, I'm glad I got the girl version though at least I completed one set yeah so back then I was like oh I don't like boy sets but now I'm like I need more boy sets <laughs> up next better fire pose one too. It was a recharge event. And now we are at the Ghost Gathering Hell event. Underworld Lord. Ooh, so here I have the night version. This actually switches over to the day version at, I believe, dawn and dusk. Uh, 6 a.m. and 6 p.m., I believe. Or was it 7? a.m. and 7 p.m. Uh, but yeah, if you were to have this entire suit on and wait in your free dressing room after the transformation time pass, you will see the transformation. It's basically like a big white flash of light and then it goes to like either the day or the night version. It's really cool. I caught this on camera when this first came out so if you want to check it out fish out my old videos <laughs> but um you don't have to wait for the time for the item to change you can manually switch by yourself so right now i'm at night version if i click the item and click the other pose it switches to the day version so here i am manually switching it by myself this will be the sofa and the makeup changes too. Really cool set. Ghost Scattering Hell Event. Really, really awesome. 
And then we have the original pose. This is the night version. Again, if you click it and select the different pose, it goes to the day version. Really, really cool. And these are like two items in one. So for example, the day version has different stats than the night version. It's really interesting because like, um, for example, let's do this little teddy bear thing. This little teddy bear chair may be top scoring in like, I don't know, one quest, but then it might not be top scoring in another quest if you switch it to this item. Yeah. The stats are completely different. That's very interesting. I think it's a good deal because the stats are 2 and 1. And then, uh oh. Ugh, this is my second time doing this. Alright, where was I? I was at the ghost gathering suits. Here we are. Miss Bone is next. Same dealio for Miss Bone. This is the night version, and you can switch it to the day version. Looks like she's sitting on a cage right now, but it's actually a carriage in the day version. Here it is. And then we have the original pose. Can easily change the items like this. Click and select. Click and select. And again, the cage becomes a carriage. The bone becomes the rain. Now, the rain is also named Bone Grave, which sometimes gets me confused because when I'm looking for this rain, I'm like, no, this item is not named rain whatever. It's named Bone Grave because the night version is a Bone Grave. So th there's that one little nuance. Up next is Prison of Life and Death turns into these petals and then the makeup turns to this makeup. And then up next we have Yama Judge, Post 1 and Post 2 from the same event. Youth Storm! Everyone should have this, right? <laughs> And then we have flower mirror. Aww. Bible dump. Why are you sad? Soul guide. Awesome for ghost scattering. Up next, uh oh. Heading towards the ranking event, we have Yatai Waitress, which includes the giant Yamato card. Here's the original pose. Bath in Starry Corridor. Pose 1 and pose 2. Love the umbrella pose here. And a goldfish girl, the grand prize for the second ranking event would be these two suits right here. Goldfish girl and the original pose. This goldfish. Here's the special pose. If you see people with this, like with a special pose, they wail. They will. <laughs> uh, or they either have a ton of stamina saved up. That's possible too. Here is the original pose. Dream of Star City. Oh, This is my newest set from the ice cream event. Love it, love it. Alice's Time Gate. It includes the eternal clock, huge massive background here, it's the original pose, Song of Night Sky, this was a recharge suit and this was one of the first recharge suits I bought. Midnight Prisoner is next, hey, hey handsome boy, <laughs> and then Crime Buster from the same prison event and oh look at the cute little corgis I love them so much <laughs> goddess of peacock was a recharge 
slower song and bad. A uh, lot going on back here. So she has this special pose. She's like leaning forward a little bit. Giant flowers in the background. Giant fan in the background. A lot of giant stuff for the set. <laughs> um, this is pretty giant too. It's this mist thing floating around behind her. And here is the original pose. Yeah, just so you can get an idea of how big this is. Castle Tides! Oh my gosh. This is my favorite suit. When I first started this game, I saw the suit in the competitions and I was like, oh my gosh, this is so pretty. <laughs> I want it so badly, so I did end up getting this in the time limit pack. So worth it. Like, I used Time Pilot so much in the starting corner. And I love the white hair too. I have a thing for white hair. <laughs> Peony Pavilion from the Chinese Opera Recharge event. Sweet Superstar. Special pose. Original pose. A love letter to the sky. Special pose. Original pose. Melody of Stars was a recharge event. Aria of Night Sky. I just got this from the circus event and it features cats oh! so i asked lee which one of these cats matches mimi or boo boo the most and he said none i feel like this cat is like boo boo when he was a baby i don't know <laughs> but mimi is a black and white tuxedo cat so she is not represented in these kitties here boo here's the original pose Joker and Magic Card, also from the same event. I finally completed this. Yay! I've seen the Joker card used in Starry Corridor in such creative ways. They're used as mirrors. They're used as ice. It's it's so good. Tons of creativity going on. Here's the original pose, and then we have some wedding suits. Oh, a flower rain. I really like this hand pose. I use this hand pose so much. So this hand pose is called Glittering Veil. Really cool. And then here is the original pose. Up next, Dream Wedding. She's bringing sexy back. Ah! And oh my gosh, the staircase I use in Starry Corridor so much. It it creates like a glittery, like sort of mist. It could create a snow effect too. So good. And here is the original pose. Sweet handbook. So I bought this during a when this was in the user shop, but I heard that this suit actually came out way before my time, and I didn't, I wasn't able to get it, so I ended up getting it in the user shop. Um, next we have time flies, and this was a recharge event. And this suit actually makes me sad because the cat is attached to the special pose here. Uh, like if you go to the original pose, where's the cat? No! <laughs> I would love to use the cat as a standalone, but unfortunately, that's not possible. Oh, uh, okay. Up next, Banshee Momiji. Oh my goodness. Also from a ranking event. I feel like at one point this was the most hated suit. Not because of how it looks, because I love the hair. I think the hair is freaking awesome. But people hated the suit because of how difficult it was to get in a ranking event. I'm not a fan of ranking events because for me, I don't want to overspend. So I end up staying until the time when ranking event ends, which is 1am to keep track of my rank. And I swear, during the last five minutes, you will drop. You will drop fast. Like I was lucky that I stayed up when I did. Ugh. And here is the original pose. Shuten Doji. This was from the Gacha. And people asked to see his undie. Here it is. 
Um, is he spicy? He's spicy too? Yeah, no? Okay. Up next, Tengu! And this includes the wings. I feel like these wings are a favorite to a lot of people. It's one of my favorites for sure. Original pose. Shashiki, also from the same ranking event. Pose one, pose two, she puts it all down. Fallen butterfly. Oh man, I love this dress because, ooh, so sexy here. <laughs> um, up next, Astro Islet from the Wasteland event. This, she's like so Jasmine from Aladdin, if only she had tanner skin. <laughs> Wind Deep Legend. Giving me an Aladdin vibe too. So cool. Christmas Adventure. Post 1 and Post 2. This was Christmas event 2017. Rondo. And it includes um, Sven. Sven, Sven the reindeer from Frozen. How do I remember that name? <laughs> um, Sven's also a hero in Dota 2. Anyway, Knight's Queen. Ooh. When you take off her crown, her aura stops glowing. See that? Like, what? I wonder if it's like that if you change other parts of her. Well, if you take off the dress, the hat stops glowing. So I guess if you have the hat and the dress combination, it'll create a glow effect. That's pretty darn awesome. This original pose do not have the glow effect, which is interesting. Only the special pose does. Again, Evernight's Hell Event, Princess Dunn. I love the feet. Oh no, I know what you are thinking. Holy feet? <laughs> no, no, no. Her feet are not holy. It's the Ajo suit with the holy feet, right? <laughs> Crane and flower. Pose one. Pose two. Claire's wish. Pose one. Pose two. Colorful dream. Perfect for Pride Month. You know what? Never mind. Every month is Pride Month. <laughs> uh, up next, Bank of Phantom. And then we have Yuki. Toonathon. Special pose and original pose. Brocade Jade. Time Love Hack includes this a giant fantasy fox in the background. Here's the original pose. Raspberry pink rock. Everyone should have this, I believe. Dream Bagpiper, also from the Ever Nights event. White Queen from the Ever Nights event. Dream Path for Traveler. This was a free suit from the Ever Nights event. Jewel of Ocean, special pose and original pose. It introduced this frame here, and I've also seen a ton of creative entries with this frame in the Starry Corridor. Poetic future. Are we back to more wedding suits? Yes, we are. I think this is my favorite wedding dress. No, it's... I think for me, it's a tie between this one and a sexy back suit. And then we have Farewell to Boudoir. Special pose, original pose, Chinese style wedding. Um, my aunt at her wedding actually wore something like this because um, the wedding was in China. So, maple sugar magic. This was a Halloween event, practically a free suit. It was super easy to get. Angie's dream. Pose one. And pose two. Angelica or Angelica? Because it says Angelica here. But it says Angelica here. Only love Nikki will know. Volley Lucia is next. Pose one. Pose two. 
moves too. This gives us such a mercy from Overwatch vibe. Okay, bike. Post one. Post two from a recharge event. Wonderful holidays. How do we get this again? Was this a free suit or a chapter? I don't remember. <laughs> uh, Wings Journey from the Mermaid Hell event. Love the arm pose here. And then we have Elegant Hibiscus. This was a user shop recharge. Rippling Silk. Uh, also from the Mermaid Hell event. This was like the first or second suit for most people. Shiba and Croak. Here is the other one from the Mermaid Hell event. Crimson Creek. Also from the Mermaid Hell event. This is the third goldfish suit that I got. The other two were from the ranking event. And then we have. Ocean Dream. The grand prize for the Mermaid Hell event. The bottom's animated. The bubble's animated. Ooh, look at that, look at that. So pretty here. Silver Bush. Woo! So this came out for the first time before I started playing again, and I'm so glad it came back as crafting because. This is one of the first suits I fell in love with. I have a thing for white hair, okay? <laughs> um, up next, Earth Bat of Girl. This one. And pose two. Fire Tiger of Tail. So this coat has the special pose. If I remove the coat, her arms are down. Put on the coat, her arms are up. Star Priest. This was a recharge suit. Magician of the Wild Chapter Suit Heaven Messenger This one is also a chapter suit I have not done the yellow version yet But I am almost done I believe I only need one more piece here Solitary Exorcist Pose 1 And Pose 2 Not done yet I just need the socks Black Rose Pose 1 And this Black Rose was a tough event because the cost of this event depends on the score you get in each stage. So the higher score you get, the less you have to pay. So if you have a small closet or if you're a newer player, this event will be tough for you. I remember playing this on Miracle Nikki where I'm V0 with a small closet and I struggled. <laughs> I struggled horribly. Ugh. So Seer, you have to complete Soul Seer in order to get Black Rose. They're from the same event. Stars and Dreams are is next, and this is from the Association. Three colors here, none of which I've completed. But I'm in a more active guild now, so hopefully it'll be faster. <laughs> Elegance. Sketch. Also from the association. Two more colors I do not have. Singing Phoenix is next. This is from the Chinese Opera User Shop Pack. NR001. She talks. This is a recharge suit and she has dialogue when you click her. Master Dinner is to be prepared according to the preset parameter. Um, I have a video of all of the words that she says. She actually says several phrases. So if you want to check that out, it's somewhere on my YouTube. <laughs> um, up next, oh, looks like we're at the time yard. Lantern Wish. The three different poses here. Pose one, pose two, and finally, this would be the pink recolor. Let's start. This is the boys' version of the Lantern's Wish. Ooh. Special pose is in the coat. Here's the original pose. Galactic Classics is next. Pose one. We're supposed to see his stool here. <laughs> so it looks like what the heck is she sitting on? Is she sitting on an invisible chair? And here is the original pose. The guy version, after you completed this set, would be Stellar Atlas. He is so sugar from BTS. Like the facial expression reminds me of sugar. 
and here is the original pose. Bond in distance. Here is pose one. She talks to. If only I could eat without gaining weight, I would be able to enjoy all kinds of delicacies to experience. Dude. For reals, girl! <laughs> and then Bond in distance. It's the original pose with her hands down. And her boyfriend would be warm nearby. Oh my gosh, I feel like this boy and the other girl are like new couples. They're like so in love with each other. Certainly not like how me and my fiance are like. like me and my fiance have been together for seven years and we are so used to each other. Uh, yeah, so unforgettable. Memory, this has a volume icon, so he talks too. The road is still the road, but the only one who walked with me is in another country. Oh, so yeah, it's a long distance relationship. Pose. Hey, iPhone here. Is that an iPhone? It looks like an iPhone 4. <laughs> um, up next, we have Wind Whisper. Post 1. Post 2. And when you have completed that, you will get the boy set. Post 1. Post 2. Yeah, unfortunately, for the time yard, you have to complete the girl set in order to get the boy set because I have a I have a guy friend that plays this game who would love these boy suits but he's unwilling to spend in a time yard up next sweet breeze free suit here go to sunshine free suit also you've poem free suit for having friends Gifty's adventure free suit loved umbrella ice blue rose free suit Heidi song Chapter suit, red rose, and time limit pack. This music box actually have tunes, as you can see it. Yeah, so it's animated. You see some glitter coming out of it, and it also plays the, you know, that one Evernight stream too. Yeah, I have it uh, on my YouTube channel too. If you look way, way, way back when, <laughs> but yeah, this tune. Is like the sweetest lullaby. I love it. Silent flowering, chapter suit, sweet sunshine. This was a free suit, and oh, I love Winnie the Pooh. Joker diamond mask, pose one. She talks and she says a bunch of depressing phrases. Why are you so serious? Like, it's not depressing now, but when you hear her, her tone is really sad sounding. Um, I also have the audio of all of her phrases in another video. Here is the original pose. Isn't it funny? I think it's a joke too. Like, literally, that's how she sounds like. She sounds so sad when she talks. Circus, like, she talks too, but she is the complete opposite. She is so joyful in her tone. Don't be so serious like that. <laughs> Here's the original pose. Hello, welcome to the December troop. Up next, we have Maiden's Romance. Four colors here, only finished one. I'm working on it, okay? There's a ton of recolors. Ugh. <laughs> As soon as I got this hair, I was like, oh my gosh, cosplay Sailor Moon. Flower Fairy Melvila, three colors here, I only have one. This is an association suit. Kitten Sketchbook, association suit too. Miss Sylvia, free suit. And here are some wedding dresses. Destined Fate. And For the Vows of Love. Ink Carp is a recharge suit skateboard girl chapter suit song of blaze i finished two of the colors here this is a chapter suit i cosplay the heck out of alexander hamilton with the suit <laughs> um water lily promise post one post two mechanical heart chapter suit Flower Lyric, ooh. I'm really sad about this suit because I really like the umbrella as a standalone item, but it's attached. 
good a call. No. Ah, uh, it is what it is. Up uh, next, Grace. Ah, uh, lifetime suits. Very hard to get. Took me like four to five months. No, way more than that. Like probably six months. Uh, was it worth it? Yeah, the feeling of accomplishment made it so worth it. And I am working on the recolor, but I would expect that it take me another three months. Very nice. Grace is the pre-version of Grace. Sweet love, free suit, bamboo song, and oh my gosh, I'm sad about this bamboo song because the background is not a movable item. This background item here. I feel like it would be a lot more creative for starry corridor purposes if this was movable. But unfortunately, that's how it is. Valentine suits, rose romance, and sweetheart. These two are pretty easy to get. Tree foil fair. This was from the competition shop. Tender puppy. This was a recharge suit and in the Chinese server you can get pieces of this suit and the gold gacha which I am really happy about because in Mirago Nikki uh, like I said I, I'm B0 I was able to get some of these pieces there I actually pulled the dress and the hat from the Mirago Nikki gold gacha and I'm like oh. <laughs> I'm getting stuff that would normally cost money for free, which is awesome. But yeah, I didn't buy it for money here. So the point of buying Jingle Kitty and Tender Puppy with money first as opposed to waiting is that you get it sooner. Uh, but yeah, if you choose to wait, you will get this free eventually in the catch up. Um, as far as I can tell, the rates are pretty good because I was able to get this this and this and a Chinese gacha fairly easily. Casablanca. This was a two dollar recharge. I believe it was a two dollar. The reason it was so cheap is because there were no top scoring items here. Colonel May. We have this animated dress and animated coat hair, really good looking. And we have Queen Elsa. Like this dress, Snow Queen. This is very like Queen Elsa in my opinion. And then Cold Winter. I love the animations here. The animation for the snow, animation for the crown, animation for the dress, oh, so good. Poppy Fox. I bought this as a recharge event, but it came back in a shop. Lightly Dancing Butterfly. Color 1. Color 2. This is a chapter suit. Working on a pink one. Almost there. Picking Strawberry. Chapter suit again. Two more colors I do not have. Up next, Dress Song. This was a free suit from New Year. Rule of Love Association suit. Still working on a recolor here. Heroine in armor, association suit. Also working on a recolor. Royal elegance, chapter suit. Ooh wee, I have a lot to work on for recolor. Cranberry, chapter suit. Yanila pirate, chapter suit. Flower tail from the time limited pack. Pink wishes, I believe everyone got this for free. I don't remember exactly how I got it, but this was one of my first suits. Ink Tail. Association suit. Pure Lotus. This is Lunar. Association suit. Dream Dress. Association suit. Love this background waist item here. So that's how it looks like without the dress. Looks really cute. This was like one of the first items. No, I think I believe this is the first item that I bought from the association suits. Fairy tail cutie! Hey, it's Bobo! Moon Vixen is next. I remember when these were the only 
ears in game. This was the top scoring item ever. <laughs> Next, Golden Dragon from the same event. Lingering Butterfly. This is from the competition shop. So Requiem. Ooh, so a couple of you asked, are the So Requiem pieces in the user shop worth it? Only if you have money to spend. Like, for me, I would not get it if I did not have the suit. Because you can get this suit without spending money, but it will have to be with diamonds. So, if you do have spare money, then I would recommend getting it. It will make your life much easier as with any kind of recharge, whether it's diamond, recharge, or... But otherwise, I would just buy this in the shop. Like the shop that costs diamonds and gold. And then, once you've completed this, you need to recolor it to Sanctity Aria. Up next, Olivia's Dress. Free suit here. Army Major. This is a chapter suit. Youth Melody. As we go on, we remember our graduation. Tribe Toda. She is so Moana, I feel like. Post one, post two. And then there is Bamboo Pavilion. Chapter suit again. Mask Beast. Post one, post two. This is a chapter suit. More wedding dresses. Happy embroidery. Ooh, look at these animated falling pillows. Childlike love. Which is what you'd wear to a... Uh... I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> this is a child wedding. I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> uh, Wisteria Bow. Purple wedding dress. This is practically free if you only use free attempts in a wedding event. Uh, next, Lunar Angel. Oh my gosh. Three different colors here. And I finished all three. This costs so much gold. Makes me so sad. My gold count depleted after completing these three colors. <laughs> Side your death. Got all three colors. One, two, and three. I think I like the white version the most. Yeah. Nightly spirit. This is a crafting suit. Dear elf, crafting suit. Voice of Prayer, Chapter Suit Canada, Chapter Suit Future Space, Chapter Suit I uh, don't have red color yet, I'm working on it Diving Carp, Chapter Suit Maple Leaf, Diver Suit Ooh. Yeah, I recolored the socks <laughs> So the socks aren't there anymore Here's the blue color uh, You don't see the stress, but here it is. If you take out the coat, which is completely dropped, blockade the dress, then you see it. Uh, Lonely Valentine Night. This was a event that came before my time. I believe it was Valentine event, and it came back for crafting. Thank goodness. I really like this pose. Peach Melody. Fluffy Lup, Chapter Suits. Polychrome, Chapter Suit. Spring Camellia, Chapter Suit. Striped Gentleman, I believe this one is for crafting Like very white and like very dark Queen of Dear Elf This was a crafting suit And so was Miss Anna You needed to get Miss Anna in order to get Queen of Dear Elf Moon in Water, gotcha suit Flower in Mirror, gotcha suit here too Woo! Lifetime suits. Here's Black Swan. Six star. Whoa. And here's the prerequisite White Swan. Dream Sail. Detective Girl from the competition shop. Star C. This was the first lifetime suit I've ever completed. Uh, lots of grinding, four months of grinding, I believe. Was it worth it? 
yeah, again, the sense of accomplishment after completing these hard as heck to craft lifetime suits. So worth it. Winter Angel. Sheer Dance. This was a free suit. Wild Flower. Chapter Suit. Blossom Season. Bright Galaxy. This dress, Dancing Queen, is for a V level, I believe. Panda Dreamland. Pose 1 and Pose 2. These are chapter suits. Cowboy Style. Chapter suits 2. Chocolate Housemaid. Mori Girl. Right there. Realized Dream. Oh my gosh. I am only able to complete this because my fiance was. <laughs> was able to pull the final item I needed to craft the dream veil. Oh, so good. My fiance actually has his uses. <laughs> oh, beautiful agent. Sweet pastry cook. Four different colors here. Color number one. Number two. Number three. And number four. Sexy bad girl. Angel in white. Hey, it's Nurse Joy. <laughs> Fast food waitress. Sacred doctor. Bunny girl. Rock singer. Diamond mermaid. This was a VIP level suit. Cutie strawberry. So is this one. V level suit. Cake manor. Gothic Lolita Divine Kite Elf Three different colors here White color Black color And pink color I like pink Pink is my favorite color But I feel like this color makes more sense For a suit <laughs> I mean, That's just me Ink Orchid Sword Girl The Purest Heart Orchid's Chant Green Willow Now these suits everyone should have, right? <laughs> uh, elegant Palinopsis Hopefully I pronounced that right Pink color And purple color Western Dancer Oh man, Lee helped me put this item He also helped me put the veil Ugh yeah, Lee is pretty useful. Higabana Princess. Story of Shanghai. Fragrance Via. Via? If it's Spanish, it'll be Via. <laughs> uh, color 1, Color 2, Color 3, and Color 4. Now, I have never used these suits as a standalone, but I color everything I can in order to inlay my wardrobe <laughs> yeah if you want a higher wardrobe count recolor everything <laughs> cinema cloud and make empress the 10 suit sort of newish to me since I just hit B10 not long ago rose maiden Nikki mechanical Jellyfish and finally my last suit Northern Soldier. So that is 265 suits. Let's go all the way to the top. Minus four because these are my four safe suits. That's 261 suits total. Wee. How long did that take? An hour? Oh. I thought I could have could make it faster compared to my stream, but oh, oh man, one hour to showcase my entire collection of suits. Wow. <laughs> All right, y'all. That is my entire wardrobe. Thank you so much for watching. I will. See you next time!